I, he broke he broke really well, um, and so you know never know with the soft turf how how it's gonna you're up there on the pace and, and then they, they started pressuring my rad from the outside and he told me that he decided to take back a little bit kind of got a little breather there we were a little wide but then as soon as you, you seen as we got closer to the quarter pole i seen he had a, a quite a bit of horse left so i was i was crossing my fingers all the way down the lane nobody was coming but we, we got lucky and we won might this horse go overseas like so many of yours do this guy um you know, I mean, right now that Jiper looks is awful enticing. It's a, it's a great one. Um, he's, he's a winner on the course. If he went over there, he'd have to run into uh, Golden Pal. I'm not, not sure anybody in the world wants to do that right now. I know there'll be several lined up to do it, but I wouldn't, I wouldn't want to line any of mine up there. He's doing tremendous, and, uh, but this horse ran a huge race today, and I'm really happy that uh, Jackson's gave me a big chance with such a great horse, especially being a homebred. And you think that's the, the Jiper six furlongs? Right, or is it six and a half? It's six, six but I, I would... That mean you think... Yeah, I don't, I don't think that's going to be a problem. He's getting older, more mature, he settles. Um, and uh, he, he's won over there on the course at that distance. So I, I, you know, and Belmont plays a little faster, I think, than this course does. So it'll let him stretch out a little bit. I mean, how good is this guy? I mean, he's, not, he's in really good form right now. Yeah, you know, he, uh, he ran a good race on his comeback. But he, it was it was a little hard for him. The, the, the turf was very very firm that day, and he came back uh, lame a couple days later. He, he had popped an abscess out of his foot, uh, so it took quite a while quite a while for that abscess to, to pop and then grow out. And ever since then, he's been just doing great. So I, th I think what got him last his last start down at Gulfstream was that firm firm course. He just he's a big old heavy horse, and he just couldn't couldn't quite handle it.